will be over. For that day when we shall lay down our burdens and study war, no more. This piece really captured the sense of disillusionment, um, a loss at a state of society, of, of violence, and that lack of connection with one another. This uh, communing with nature and then the vibrancy of childhood came through for me as well. And that music track in the background just felt so atmospheric and, and well suited to the emotional drive of the piece. So overall, I thought it was a really cohesive, uh, clear vision. So Solace Genesis was such a interesting short. Uh, for something that's so short, it was able to kind of convey this entire day of um, just going to school and not having the best feelings about it. It was just kind of a depressing time to be in and everything's just kind of against you. You're being picked at, all of that. And then having to go home, having to deal with the family that's um, neglectful, not really paying attention to them either. And then still being able to find the sense of hope at the very end of it, even with the involvement of some alien beings. But um, overall, it was just a really great message of hope. And uh, that there's always something better on the other side. And it, you got to see the progression through that. You got to see how it kind of worked throughout the, the one day. So... Um, it was just great to see and in terms of story and then animation wise I thought it was just um, simple but effective and the color choices of it all just made it make sense too it started with the darks the grays the white the blacks and then at the very end just kind of progressed more into color so um, really great choice in doing that too so great job I really liked this I liked that it started off uh, with like it was all black and white except his red um little uh like little red cross and then as they layered in and layered in and layered in the audio it just built and built and built and it all kind of snowballed really really well together um and then eventually they bring in more color and more parts and I just thought it all worked really really well together but I really liked how it started off like really simple and really um like a stark contrast of like black and white and like relatively quiet background and then it built and built and built and you just got more and more and then you got more color and more everything I thought it was really well done it is like a dream and has so many parts of it that uh could have multiple interpretations for example i think that the piece discusses both um man's propensity for violence and destruction as well as um our propensity for pollution and and harming the planet as well as each other it seems to talk about both of those things and call for peace and restoration and we seem to get this intergalactic help which you know, we certainly wish we could receive right now. Um, it is optimistic, however. I don't think it's a downbeat piece. And it's a piece that in itself feels like a dream and is itself dreaming of a better tomorrow. I enjoyed that sort of cell shaded look. Um, I thought it was an interesting commentary on war um, and the use of repetition in that, that line in the... Uh, in the audio that just repeats itself um, with such great effect. I just thought it was really smartly done, uh, just worth experiencing, really. I, I thought this one was really, really cool. I like the animation style. I like that it's kind of like a 3D, also sort of drawn. Um, you know, I think the, the main thing that sticks out with this short is the use of color. And I, and I think that they use it in a really creative way. Um, you know, by highlighting specific stuff, like starting with like sort of the red where his heart is, and then, you know, he goes into his room and it's really colorful. And then um, on the spaceship, it's also very colorful. And yeah, I just, uh, I thought it was, it was well made. And I thought the music went well. It kind of, it felt almost like an early 2000s, kind of like 90s short in the sense that sort of like this kind of like techno grunge, um, aesthetic and yeah I don't know I, I really I dug it and I, I think that the um, filmmaker had a uh, clear vision
yeah, I really dug this film. Um, the music was really cool. I really loved the animation style. It was, you know, I didn't fully understand it, but not like in a bad way, like in a way that like it made me think. And like, I feel like I'm going to still be thinking about this film for like the rest of the day, maybe even tomorrow. Like there's just, yeah, the music and the way the characters are designed and the lack of color in the beginning is kind of like this haunting quality to it that I really moves me in a really weird and cool way and like a way I like to be feel when I'm watching a movie um so yeah I just dug it um and the alien stuff at the end was cool cool alien design so yeah I really liked it I, I thought it was really cool and unique really liked this movie. It was very sweet. Um, I really loved the character of the little boy and and without dialogue really showed us everything he was going through. It was really wonderful. The animation was fantastic. The music was great. I loved the characters. I loved the storytelling. Um, I thought it was really well directed and very well written. So I just, I really enjoyed this, um, this film and congratulations. It's really lovely.